So Frontier has three seniors, but before we get to them, we would like uh, to, uh, to mention uh, Lee's seniors. They have two, and one of them is Aaliyah Noel. And one other senior, one that uh, we've run into a few times in big games, and um, finally a senior, we want to honor Suriana Lee. And uh, not here tonight, but I do want to mention uh, we've had a lot of really great matches with Lee over the years. Um, they have a new coach tonight, and I just wanted to mention, um, you know, we've had some really great battles with John Warner, and John Warner has really done a lot for me in Lee Volleyball, and uh, he and I started coaching at the same time in 2003, and we both talked about exit plans and how long we were going to do this and things like that, but I really wanted to mention on a night like this, since we're talking about uh, people that will be there next year. Um, that John, you know, the respect that we have for John and Lee High School and Lee Volleyball and what uh, John has been able to do. And I know that one of John's big, big, big concerns when he was ready to step down was who would take it over. And I think he's found the perfect person. Um, I've known Julia for at least probably 10 or 12 years. I know I coached her in the summer at Bay State Games back when she was in high school, so I can't personally think of anybody better excuse me, to hand me high school and the volleyball over to them. So I want to welcome Julia here.
with you on this team than anyone on any team I've ever played on. And let me say it's been a good ride. When you were in ninth grade and you were news, together we experienced what it was like to be on a real varsity team. We were both in awe of talent ahead of us, but at the same time ready to take on the roles. In the following years, we developed as players and teammates. I had the great pleasure of sharing the court with you and being your friend. For those of you who don't know, Jalen is an exceedingly kind and wonderful person. She has the ability to crack jokes in the court while also being completely driven and focused. I have always felt comfortable around you. That's just the kind of person you are. You are willing to make conversation with anyone and everyone. You make bus rides a hundred times more fun and are always excited to be with you. Thank you for being so kind to me and showing me what it means to be a great teammate. There is no doubt in my mind that our friendship will continue in the years to come. And lastly, good luck at college. I'm sure you will do great things. <laughs> oh, and P.S. R.I.P. Back Row Greenles. <laughs> Jalen, my first year in varsity, I came into practice terrified and you immediately met me with open arms. We made every game fun on the bench together, hiding from Sean so we could stay on the bench laughing instead of playing. You've grown to my big sister and her friend through our inside jokes and your constant support for the team on and off the court. We cried and laughed together, which is something I'll always remember and I'll always be grateful for. You're incredibly fun to play with and incredibly fun just to be around. You've grown so much and have grown into a leader on the court, which is something anyone can vouch for. I will forever miss hanging up streamers with you and your smiles in the hallway. You will always be a part of this team and will always be my big sister. Thank you for everything you've done for me and for this team. <laughs> I love you a lot, Spiro, and I can't wait to see the amazing things you will do. I can't personally think of anybody better, excuse me, to handle the high school. 
school and meet volleyball and all things. So I want to welcome Julia here.
where we would always stay together at the end of the line on the bench and just like talk the whole time. And you would always like tell stories and make jokes. And I know like I will miss those like the most like out of everything playing with you. You are such a supportive and incredible friend and you are so inspiring like with everything you do and how like unbelievably kind you are to every person you meet and I miss you so much. Ben, I've known Ben since second grade, which was my first year playing volleyball for Frontier. He's always been someone I can ask for help, whether it has to do with volleyball or just something going on in my life. It's gotten to the point where he might know a little more about me than he ever wanted, but either way, I learned to appreciate all that he has done for me and other players on this team. You watched me go from Angelica's team onto Gordon's team, and I'm finally the team. You've been with me through it all, and I hope you'll watch the last few years of my high school. You've grown to be a better figure of my life, but I'm really sad to see you go. Nonetheless, I wish you the best of luck in college and please go back to the home. Incredibly fun just to be around. 
You've grown so much and have grown into a leader on the court, which is something anyone can vouch for. I will forever miss hanging up streamers with you and your smiles in the hallway. You will always be a part of this team and will always be my big sister. Thank you for everything you've done for me and for this team. <laughs> I love you a lot, Spiro, and I can't wait to see you in the things you will do. Volleyball on Frontier Community Access Television. Tonight's game on the Frontier Red Hawks by host Lee Wildcats on senior night in South Deerfield here with the gymnasium. Chris Collins, along with Alan Kickle, and Megan Self. Here getting ready for the big game. And Frontier comes in with a record of 11 and 6, 4 and 3 in league play. Lee Wildcats come in with a record of 14 and 1. They are unbeaten in league play, 8 and 0. So it could be a tall order for Frontier as they come in, prepared to honor their two graduating seniors, actually three graduating seniors, one of which is manager of the team. We'll talk about them later on in the broadcast, but right now let's go down to the starting lineups for tonight's game.
go. Frontier on senior night honoring their three seniors, Captain Jalen Sullivan, who's been part of the program for six seasons, four on varsity. Kamani Topolsky has been in the Red Hawk Volleyball program for four years, three on varsity. And Ben Bardwell has been assisting the Frontier Volleyball program since his seventh grade year. He now attends Franklin Tech, but still comes back and helps out with the team here at Frontier. So congratulations to Ben, Kimani, and Jalen. As a tall order tonight, they have one more league game against Longmeadow and then Hopkinton, where they play at Hopkinton, and then of course the postseason. And uh, Frontier, of course, has always been, at least historically, been very much in the conversation, not only for Western Mass Championship, but also for the state championship. I don't know if a state championship is in the cards this year, but uh, they'll be competitive and a tough out in the postseason. Soriano Lee for the Wildcats, one of the two captains, will serve it to start this game. We play best of five. First team to win three sets wins the match. The first four sets are to 25. And the final set, if necessary, the fifth set will be to 15. Lee, one of the seniors, or, or one of the seniors on this Lee team, serves it. Set by Rose, one spike. And the point goes to Frontier to start things off. And that was Jalen Sullivan at the net with the spike, one nil. And Sullivan now will go back and serve for Frontier. Way long, 1-1. One, one. Service goes back to Lee. Lizzie Brown to serve for the Wildcats out of Berkshire County. Good dig by Sullivan. Rose one sets. Dean with a spike. And that's going to be out. 2-1 Lee. Lizzie Brown. To serve. Good dig, Sullivan to Rose Warren. Once again, the D with the spike. Point. Tough to return that. A lot of mustard on that one. Rose Warren, 276 assists coming into this game. Right back at it. Riley Isler to serve. Good low serve. Able to return it. Sullivan to Rose Warren to Dean. And they're going to call a point as there is a frontier player on the net. So serving it now is Caitlin Clark for the Lee Wildcats. That's going to go long, but they the, as they're excited to play it. And Teposki unable to. Tip it over the net and makes the score 4-2. And Clark to serve again. So to Rose Warren. And a nice tip over by Appenel. Returned by Lee. Sullivan to Rose Warren. Look at the Dean. 4-3 Lee. <coughs> Frontier will serve. Quick substitution into the game, Megan Martineau, or Morgan Martineau rather, for Frontier. And it's going to be Sydney Scanlon, the 5 5 freshman, to serve for the Red Hawks. Point. Lee. And they get the service back. 5 3 Lee. Leia Noel. The other senior captain for Lee to serve. Sullivan. Scanlon. Appenel. And it was played off the hand of Clark. That's a point for Frontier. 
5-4. Arguably Frontier's best server, Olivia Dean now with the ball. She had 48 aces coming into this game. And that one is just out, so the point goes to Lee. Javi Joyce to serve for the Wildcats, leading 6-4. Uh, Good serve, Isler, and returned by Sullivan. That's a point for Frontier. 6-5 Lee, Frontier with the serve, Apinel. To send it over for Frontier. That ties the game at 6 6. And Apinel will serve again. That one just got over. Set. Spike. It's going to go long. Oh, no, nope, nope, it was in. Just in. 7 6. Nice play there by Noel, who scored that point. And it will be Michaela Beckwith, excuse me. It will be Emma, Emma Perry, Flurry, who will serve. And Frontier gets the ball back, tied 7 7. It will be Rosemary to serve for the Hawks. Point for Lee, and just, just. So we have a lead to serve for the Wildcats. Dean, the dude, Rose one, is set, spike, point. That was Charlotte Dulet doing the honors there. Ties the game at eight. And Sullivan to serve for Frontier. Sullivan, the Rosemary, Dean, Spike, return, Dean, second Spike, return. And Wildcats able to pull over, is there? The Rosemary for Dean again. Good dig by Lee. Set by Rosemary, and good volley going here. Set the Spike point. That's going to be Lizzie Brown to get that point for the Lee Wildcats. And Brown will go back and serve it up. 9 8. Good first match here. Very competitive. And then both these teams play off bound. Lee has not lost in league play this year. And they're Lee. Isler tries to return it. And it's going to be technically an ace as it was not returned. 10 8. Lizzie Brown to serve again for Lee. Kick back over by Frontier. Set. Spike. Is there with the dig. Carose one with the set. And a spike by Dean returned again by Lee. Good midcourt play by the Wildcats. And that's going to be a point. A set from Rose Warren to Doulette. And Frontier gets the serve back. 10-9 Lee. Riley Isler to serve. Deep serve. And what's the call? Point goes to Frontier. He just landed inside the line. 10 10. Is there to serve again? That's going to be an ace for Riley. So Frontier takes its first lead, 11 10. Is there to serve again? A deep serve. Spike. Nice dig. 
Is there now? Plays it back. Dean tips it over. Kept alive by the Wildcats. Isler to Rosewarn. To Dean. Block at the net. Nicely done by Lee. Another block at the net. Isler is able to return it. Kept in play by the Wildcats. Sullivan now with the dig. Rosewarn to Dean. The spike hit. Great volley there, comes out on the side of the Hawks. 12-10. Riley is set to serve again. That's gonna be returned, just barely. Rose one sets it, Dean sends it over. And returned by Lee. Set by Rose Warren. A spike. Just inside the line by Kanani Topolsky on senior night. 13 10. Frontier's largest lead of the game. And Isler still serving. And no serve. Set. Spike at the net. Point. And that was Kylie Joyce for Lee. It's an important point, breaks the service of Frontier, and it will be Caitlin Clark to serve. Is there with the dig? That's basically going to be an ace. 13 12 as it is not returned by Frontier. Dean. 14-12 Frontier. And Dean, after scoring that point, will serve it. Not, actually, no, she won't. It's going to be quick substitution. Sid Scanlon comes back. So Sid Scanlon's going to serve it for Frontier. Knuckle serve. Tip back over. Is there with the save? Scale on the set. Spike by Dean. And that's not going to be return. 15 12. Frontier by three. Scanlon will serve again. Knuckle serve. Pretty low. Over Sullivan. Sent back over by Scanlon. Set. Spike. Point. And again, bringing the hammer that time was Kylie Joyce. L.A. and Old. Serve for Lee Sullivan to scam in the set to Dean Point. Dean did a good job on the outside with the hits. 16 13 Frontier. And now Dean will serve. Dig, set, spike, point. I didn't think I say a point went to Frontier. 17-13. I thought that was the point that went to Lee, but I think there was somebody on the net, so Dean will serve. Good jump served by Dean. That's going to be an ace. Eighteen thirteen. Frontier with a five-point lead. Game one here. Best of five. Another tough knuckle serve. Turn Dean to Scanlon. Big spike at the net by Appel. Return by Lee. Cross court spike. Frontier point. 1913 as that ball was out. Dean to serve again. Oh, 
Ooh. It's just out. 1914. And Kylie Joyce, sophomore to serve for Lee. Hard serve. Is there at the dig? Sends it back over. And that one's going to go long. Punt will go to Frontier. 2014. Hawks. Appenel to serve for Frontier. It's going to be an ace for Jill. 21-14. Time out on the floor. We'll take the break. Hawks have the serve. We return. This is we're not volleyball. Frontier Community Access Television. Chris Collins, Alec Echo, and Megan Self back out here at Frontier Regional School at Hawks. After a pretty tight first part of this match, have opened up a bit of a lead, 21 to 14, over the Lee Wildcats. And the Wildcats come in with only one loss in the season, 14 and one overall, 8 0 in their league. And uh, to the Hawks would do well to finish them in this game and get an advantage because a lot of volleyball still to play. Happen on to serve. Low serve. And someone was on the net there, 22-14. Happen out to serve again. Good low serve. Come at me. Out and it'll be the Frontier or Lee rather to serve Emma Polari. Standing with the set. Sullivan the spike. 23-15. Frontier with the serve again. This is gonna be Olivia Rose Warren. A deep serve. Set. Spike. That's going to be a point. Israel tried to do her best to, to save that one, but that was just a well placed shot by number 20, Kylie Joyce. Another time on the floor will take the break. Frontier still leading 23 16. Game one. Good note to Maisie. Frontier can go to the exit zone. So Frontier, a couple of points away from taking game one of the best of five match. Senior number in South Korea. And Sir Anna Lee will serve it for the Wildcats of Lee. Sullivan to Rose Warren. Spike, still alive. Sent back over by Lee. Goes on with the set. Nobody there though. 23 17. Need to serve again. Dean to Rose Warren. Kicked over by Appadale. With the live. Oski rather. Set. And it's going to be a lead point. 23-18 for the Wildcats on their way back. That one hits the net. 24-18. Not the game point for Frontier. And it'll be Jalen Sullivan to serve. Good low serve. Point Frontier, and that is the end of game one. They played one game from South Carolina at the end of one. Frontier leads. They win game one, 25-18. Game two upcoming, Red Hot Volleyball. Frontier is going to be Game two upcoming, Frontier. Winning game one by a count of 25-18, a game that started off looking like Lee was going to open it up, and then uh, Frontier came back, some good serves, good net play. And uh, Frontier will play now right to left for the second game. And will, I believe, start off with the ball. <laughs> J. 
Charlotte Dulette and Olivia Dean at the net along with Topolsky. Kistler is back out, and it should be Jalen Sullivan to serve to start game two. Serve, set, return, Isler to Rose Warren. And spike of the net, Goulet got it through, one nothing from two. Good attempted at block at the net by Lee, but just too much mustard on that spike. Sullivan to serve again. Good deep serve, tough to return, and they won't be able to. Two nothing from two. by Sullivan. This one is not going to get returned either. So three unanswered points by the Red Hawks here in game two. And the freshman, or the senior rather, Jalen Sullivan, one of the captains, one of the seniors. Good deep serve again. In return by Lee. Set. Turned by Frontier. Isler with the day to Rose Warren, the set to Dean, hammer time. 4-0. Red Hawks cruising here in game two. Set, spike, point. As nicely done at the net by Lizzie Brown. For Lee, that's Lee's first point of the match. And it'll be Soriano Lee to serve for the Wildcats. Dean turns, sets, spike at the net. Got the live by Sullivan. Goes warm. Polsky sends it back over. And point frontier. Was unable to get it over the net was Noel. And Riley Isler will serve. Frontier with a 5 1 lead here in game two. No serve. Set. Took back over. Isler sets it. Dean with a short tip. Good return. Good keep alive by Lee. And they're unable to return it actually. A little tip over by. Dean was just enough to get the job done. 6-1, and Isler will serve again. Long serve out. 6-2 now, Lee will get the ball back. And Lizzie Brown will serve. Sullivan, Rose Warren sets to Dean, spike, block at the net, point lead. Oh. No, I'm sorry, the point goes to Frontier. I think the lead player was on the net, they're saying. So 7-2 Hawks, and Sid Scanlon will serve for Frontier. Served by Scanlon. Point for Lee. As that was Aaron Brisbois who popped that one over the top. And it's going to go back to Caitlin Clark to serve for the Wildcats. No serve is there to Dean. Point. That one dropped into no man, no person's land. And Olivia will serve now with an 83 lead for Frontier. Good 
serve by Dean. Sent back over, Sullivan. Scanlon back to Sullivan, Spike. Kept alive. Nice job to return it by Appenau. Spike, is there the dig? Scanlon the set, looking for Sullivan. Point. 9-3 Frontier. Olivia Dean to serve again. It's a good volleys in this game, but Frontier so far has had the better of it than that. Ace. That was unreturnable. 10-3 Frontier. And they won game one by seven points, 25 to 18. Sullivan. Ace. Back to back aces. 11 3. Dean is really sort of taking advantage of the left side of that net. Another tough one. This one gets returned though. And out. 12 3. I'm out on the floor, we'll take the break. Frontier cruising in game two. Red Hawk volleyball. Frontier to the exit. Ah! So the Frontier Red Hawks coming in here, I was expecting a pretty competitive game so far in the second game. Anything but. 12 3 Frontier by nine. Olivia Dean with the ball to serve. As the Wildcats gotta get something going here if they wanna get back in this thing. They've lost game one and they're trebling badly in game two. Serve again by Dean. Sent back over. Is there? Goes to the floor for it. Tipped by Scanlon to Sullivan. Good spike. Kept alive by the Wildcats. Boom. Dean. The dig. Set. Spike. Still alive. Dean sets to Scanlon. Spike. By Appenau. Still alive. Oh, and Appenau. Caught it at the net, was trying to block the net, but caught it. Can't do that, so it's a lead point. And more importantly, it breaks the serve of Dean, who had a hot hand during that stretch. Lee Noel to serve for Lee. Trailing by eight. Ace. That's just what the doctor ordered for the Wildcats. Well, five frontier. Noel with the serve. Scanlon tries to load the fourth foot. That's going to be an ace. So two unreturnable serves so far by the senior captain, Noel. Good serve again. 12 6 frontier. Serves. Scanlon. Dean puts it back over. Set. Spike. Blocked. Dean keeps it alive to Scanlon. Scanlon to Sullivan. Sullivan spikes it. Oh. 13 6 Frontier. And Jillian Appenau will serve. 5 10 freshman. Play. D. Set by Scanlon. Spike. Kicked alive. Set. Tipped. Point. Nice tip by Kylie Joyce there to get the point. 13 7. And Joyce will go back and serve. to Lee, 
out. 14-8, Frontier gets the serve back. The subs coming in. Rose Warren's coming back in, as is Topolsky. Uh, and sitting down is Fredericks and Stanley. Served by Rose Warren, lefty serve. Good deep serve, still alive. Dean to Rose Warren. And Topolsky tried to spike it. Couldn't get it over the net. 14-9. Frontier by five, Lee with the serve. Goes one with the set. Spike. Still alive. Sent back over. Rose one to Israel with the set. Sullivan the spike. And that's going to be out. 14-10. So Lee creeping back into it. We're down by as much as nine. And now trail only by four here in the second game. And that serve is out, 15-10, Frontier. And Sullivan the serve for the Red Hawks. Good low, not the serve. And the point goes to Lee as he was sent back over by Soriano Lee and Parsley blocked by Dean, but not enough. 15 10, 15, 11 rather, and Lee with the serve. Set by Rosemore looking for Dean. Spike. That goes to Lee as there was some. Movement on the legal hit there, I think. 15 12. Goes Warren to Dean. Dean's spike is sent back, and it's going to be a point for the Wildcats. 15 13. So just like that, Lee claws their way back into it. And time out on the floor will take the break. Frontier 15, Lee 13. This is Red Hot Volley. Well, the Frontier Red Hawks had a nine point lead. One point is that the Red Hawks is down to two points. And Lee still has the serve. Frontier, of course, won game one, 25 to 18. This is game two. And the team that gets to three games first wins the match. Soriano Lee to serve. Sullivan to Rosewall. Tobolsky sends it back over. Sets. And the point's going to go to Frontier. 16-13. And Riley Islip to serve for Frontier. A low serve by Islip. Set. Spike. Sullivan. For Rose Warren. Dean. And the point's going to go to Frontier. It was deflected off of the Lee Wildcat player. 17-13. Isler put it in play again. Nobody there. Ace. low serve. Return by Lee. Rose Warren with the set to Polsky. The spike. Good play. Sent back over. Blocked the net. Still alive. Good play to keep it alive. Dean and Appenel still alive. Great play at the net by Appenel again. Point Frontier. But that was Jillian Appenel and Olivia Dean. Kept that thing alive. Nicely done. 19-13. Isler to serve it. The post serve. Set. Spike. Out. Frontier point. 20-13. So the Hawks. 
And the Verge are going up two games in this series. Let's in this match. Just like. Sends it over. Set. Spike. Out. Frontier point. 21-13. So the serving of Riley Isler in this last exchange has been the difference. That and great net play by the Hawks. A good serve. Set. Spike. Point. Again, Jill Appenau having a great game at the net. 22-13. So the Hawks have not trailed in this game. This one. And he keeps it alive. Scanlon tipped over by Dean. And the point's going to go to, they're going to say someone in the net, I believe. Point to Lee, 22-14, and Lizzie Brown will serve. Sullivan to Rosewall, to Dean, spikes it, point frontier. 23-14, couple of subs coming in now. Reese Fredericks coming in as is Sidney Scanlon. For Frontier, Sid will serve. 23-14. Appenau at the net, nice play! Once again, Jillian Appenau, the star of this game. Game point for Frontier, as Scanlon to serve. Serve. Kept them play by Lee Isler. And unable to return it with Scanners came across court to get it. 24 15. Lee will serve. This is still game point. Caitlin Clark to serve for the Wildcats. Dean to Scanlon. Sets for Dean. Spike! Point game. We'll switch ends at the end of game two. Frontier winning that one 25 to 15. Game for the upcoming Red Hot Volleyball. Frontier can the access to Chris Collins, Megan Self, and Alec Echo. Out here, game three about to get underway. Frontier has won the first two games, 25 to 18 and 25 to 15. And the Wildcats have got to win this game to avoid a three-game sweep. And the first team to win three games wins the match. Soriano Lee. Puts it in play. Lee to Rosewine. Flips it over. And that was an interesting little spike by Kylie Joyce just inside the line. One nothing me. Out. One one. Sullivan to serve for the Hawks. And left to right. Sent back over. Goes one to Dean. Unreturnable spike there. 2 1 Frontier. Sullivan to serve again. Lee with the set. Isler to Rose Warren. Big spike at the net by Martino is good. 3-1. And looks like he got uh, an illegal hit. So it's 4-1 Frontier. I don't 
quite a night for the Hawks. I thought this was going to be a tough contest. So far, it has not been for Frontier. Sullivan to serve. That's going to be out. 4-2. Lee with the serve. Liz Brown. Abby Roberts checks into the game for Frontier, and Sullivan checks out. Isler to Rose Warren. Tipped over by Duet. Spike at the net. Joyce just couldn't quite get it over. 5 2 Frontier. And Riley Isler. Actually, no, not be Riley Isler. It will be Charlotte, Charlotte Duet. Won't be Charlotte Duet. This is coming out of the game. It'll be Tia Gottschalk. Tia Gottschalk to serve for Frontier. Deep serve. Turn by Lee. Set by Rose Warren for Dean. In. 6 2. That was just inside the line. Olivia Dean has had a great night at the net. So has Julian Appenau. And it's 6-2, Frontier Cruising. Glass Chuck with the serve. Sent back over by Lee. To Rose Warren. Spike at the net. Point Frontier. And that was Topolsky doing the honors. Fox Cruising in game three. Lots chalk to serve. Almost headed out, but they returned it. They tried to. Sent back over. Good point again. That was Kylie Joyce. She's got that play where she, it's not really a spike at the net. She just sort of hammers it over the top, and it's right where nobody was. So that breaks frontier service. And Aaron Brisboy to serve. For Lee. Dean. For Rosemary. Great little hit by Morgan Martineau. Again, not a spike so much as a push. And it went off the lead player. So Frontier gets the serve back. 8 3 with the lead. And checking into the game is Lila Evans for Frontier. It's going to be Sid Scanlon, who's also back into the game, to serve. Or Frontier. Tough low serve. Tip back over. Set by Scanlon. And tip at the net by Evans. Could not get it over. 8-4. This is Aya Noel to serve. Tough serve. Scanlon with the set. Dean with the spike. Point. Well, if you can get that ball to Olivia Dean tonight at the net, that outside hit, I think you're going to have a lot of success because she has really been phenomenal at the net tonight. And now she is going to serve, leading 9 4. Ace. That handcuffed everybody on the right side there for Lee. Tell you, with Wildcats are on the verge of having a very long ride back up over to the Berkshires at the rate this game is going. 10 4 Frontier. Frontier has won the first two games. They can win the match with a win here in this game. Another tough serve. Sent back over. Dean returns it. A nice tip at the net by Kylie Joyce, who's having herself quite a game. And she will go back and serve it. 10-5. Dean will check out and into the game. Olivia Simonet. Out. Frontier point, 11-5. And Kamani Topolsky will serve for Frontier. 
One of two seniors on this Frontier team. Good low serve, ace. That one just cleared the net and nobody knew how to handle it on the lee side of the ball. That was just a very, very tough serve to return. 12-5 Frontier. Nice play at the net by Lee. That might have been, who was that? That was Lee who sent that one over. It was going to be a play that they were going to score on, but they did. And the Wildcats will serve Kitten Clark. To put it in for Lee. Is that? Set. Nice return by Sullivan. Scanlon at the net. Good block by Aaron Grisbois on the net. And she went up and blocked Charlotte Duet very well. 12 7. Scanlon to Sullivan. Net. And just like that, the Wildcats are starting to amount of comeback. Looks like in game two, 12-8. Isler, Scanlon, again. Doulette, could not get it over the net. 12-9. to nine. So things are starting to break down a bit for Frontier midway part of this match. Set by Scanlon, Sullivan. Again, could not clear the net. And Sean McDonald wants to talk about it. We'll take the break. Frontier leads Lee in game three. 12 10. Spread out volleyball. Frontier for the access television. Now, don't have a pretty good lead with the Red Hawks now. Only leading by two. 12 10. And Clark with the serve for Lee. Is there? Sullivan, he will turn it. Set, spike, and that's going to be in. 12 11. Lee can tie the game, his third game, with a point here. Isler, Sullivan sends it over and keeps it alive. Scanlon to Isler, to Sullivan. Out. 12-12. Lee can take the first lead of the match with a point here. And now we're gonna get some subs back in. Olivia Dean coming back into the game. And checking back out is Olivia Simino. Tough serve just over the net, set. Legal hit. And Lee has the lead, 13 to 12. Their first lead of this game. Clark puts it in. That's going to be an ace. 14 12. And the Wildcats starting to feel it here in game three. Yeah. A break for the Red Hawks as Clark was starting to serve really well there. And Rose Warren checking back in. As is Morgan Martin. It's going to be Rose Warren that's going to serve for Frontier. That lefty serve of hers. The deep serve. Sent back over by Lee. Sets Sullivan could not clear the net. 15 13, Lee with the lead and the serve. Surrey Lee, one of the captains of this Wildcat team, to serve. Dean for Rose Warren. Sullivan sends it over. Rick Set, Spike, dig by Dean. Rose Warren to Sullivan, point. Oh. 
15-14, and Sullivan will serve. Point Frontier, as that one just did not quite stay in. 15 all, Sullivan to serve. Set, Point Frontier. There's no one not clear the net. 16-15, Hawks will get retain the game of lead. Sullivan to serve again. Ace. Straight up, unreturnable serve. 17-15. The dig, set, spike, blocked at the net by Charlotte Dulette. 18-15, Hawks are gaining their mojo here. Sullivan. Next. 1860. Lizzie Brown to serve for Lee. This thing. Rose Warren tipped over by Dean. Sent back over. Isler, Dean, Spike, good return by Lee. Those one sends it back to Dean. Point. No, it's actually point for Lee. 1817. Brown to serve again. This thing. Except to Rose Warren. Spike point. Once again, Charlotte Doulette doing the honors at the net. Doulette at the net. And Abby Roberts is going to hand it off to Tig Upchuck. Checks into the game. Good serve by Gottschalk. Back over by Lee. And that's going to be a point for Lee. There to be some confusion there in the Frontier midcourt. 1918. Aaron Brisbois to serve for Lee. Out. 2018. Frontier five points away from a straight reset win over the 14 and one Lee Wildcats. Scanlon back in, as is Elise Friedrichs. Scanlon will serve. the net. Still alive by Lee. They're set. And they're not going to return it. 21-18. Scanlon to serve again. Frontier four points away from a big win on Seymour. Set, tipped over, a blocked at the net by Caitlin Clark. Was able to come over and just sort of get a hold of that tip over by Fredericks. 21-19, Alaya Noel to serve for Lee. Net, 22-19. Frontier gets the serve back and who gets the ball but Olivia Dean, their best server, three points away from Pater. Oh, 
Oh. Returned. Isler to Scanlon. And the point's going to be for Lee as there was an illegal hit there. 22 20. Caitlin Clark to serve for the Wildcats. Good tough serve. Still in play. Dean sends it back. Set. Spike. Point. 22 21 Frontier. Lee with the serve. Kylie Joyce again. Whistler to Scanlon. Sent back over by Dean. Set. Checked in play. Nope. 22 22. Time out on the floor. We'll come back to see who wins this one. We're all tied at 22 in game three. This is Red Hot Volleyball. 22 22. The Wildcats have two games to none in this best of five matchup. The next couple of points are going to be crucial to see if they can extend this match beyond three games. Joyce serving. Ouch! 23-22, that could be significant. Kanani Topolsky to serve it for Frontier. Nope. 24-22, match point. Upcoming. Tough one, game. So Frontier defeats the Lee Wildcats, only the Wildcats' second loss this season in straight games. 25-18 in game one, 25-15 in game two, and 25-22 in game three. So Frontier improves to 12 and six overall as they have a matchup with Longmeadow, a league matchup this week, and we'll see you in the postseason as we continue our coverage of Frontier Red Hot Ball. For Alec Eckert and Megan Self, this is Chris Collins saying so long for the good amazing. Thanks for watching. Frontier Regional Volleyball, Frontier Community Access Television.